Un attempted to launch what is believed to be a mid range ballistic missile from a site north of his capital in Pyongyang on Friday. But both US and South Korean military sources state the missile broke up shortly after launch above the Korean Peninsula. The launch came after Donald Trump threatened the Hermit Kingdom with war if they did not seize their nuclear missile program. Speaking on condition of anonymity, a U.S. military source said new naval drills and more warships could be sent to the Korean Peninsula in a further show of force. The USS Car Vinson war fleet has been deployed to the area in anticipation of another missile launch. But the tubby tyrant reacted angrily to this, vowing to wipe out the aircraft carrier with a single missile. The military source said. It's possible that something could be sped up. Something that's ready to go could be taken from the larger package and expedited. The source added that the missile launch was the kind of provocation that had been expected before South Korea's May 9 election and that Donald could use it as leverage to press China to do more in North Korea he tweeted. North Korea disrespected the wishes of China and its highly respected president when it launched, though unsuccessfully, a missile today. Bad. The UN Security Council is likely to start discussing a statement to condemn the missile launch, said diplomats, adding that it was unlikely to be issued on Friday. The Security Council traditionally condemns all missile launches by Pyongyang. Japan condemned the launch as absolutely unacceptable and a violation of UN resolutions. There was no immediate reaction from China. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.